It's time for Ask the Love Coach with love and relationship coach, Michelle Fabrica. Hello. Welcome. Are you ready for our next letter? Let's hear it. They write, Dear Love Coach, my partner and I have some physical challenges, which makes being comfortable during sex very difficult. We try and we enjoy ourselves for a while, but then one of us gets tired of being in that position. What can we do? And they remain anonymous. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's a great question. So, you know, I'm sorry you're having some physical challenges this way. And, um, you know, of course, you're not alone, as you probably know. I mean, eventually, many of us have challenges with our bodies. And, you know, we're not as physical or as strong or as nimble as we used to be. Um, and so, you, yeah. And you know what? I love but you're not letting that discourage you from being sexual because I believe, you know, sexuality, our sexuality is our birthright and we ought to be enjoying it for as long as we choose to in our lives. So awesome for that. So um, I also want to say, obviously, you know, taking pauses during sex, changing positions, regroup, maybe take some time to just snuggle and touch each other and um, stay close. Those are always options during sex. It doesn't have to just, you know, get started and continue on a certain, you know, pathway. But I do hear that, you know, you'd like, sounds like you get some, there's some frustration there maybe that you, you know, are getting maybe more and more aroused and you'd like to continue, but your bodies are not willing to continue in those positions. So obviously you always need to honor your body and, um, and it's good to really honor your other, your partner's body, of course, and to make sure you're, um, you know, uh, holding a positive attitude towards it, right? Not like, ah, oh, my body is is not, you know, giving me what per performing the way I want it to, right? Right? Because we got to love our bodies just as they are. So a couple of things that can help. Um, well, two things really. First of all, you know, I want to encourage you to, you know, if you're not already, use some sex toys because you know vibrators and other toys like that, they have a lot more stamina than our hands and fingers or our tongues, right? So try that together, see how that works. And then another idea is sex furniture. I know, it's a thing, right? So um, there are a lot of options here. There are certain shaped pillows, there's wedges, there's actual couches and our sex swings, right? So there are ways that they can support us, support our bodies so we don't have to do you know, support our own bodies to help us support our partner's bodies so we can be in positions together to enjoy, um, you know, juicy sex together. So there's a link below to a great article and um, see what you can discover there. Have fun. To submit your question for Michelle, contact her at celebratingact2.com slash ask.